Hey, quick question for you. Did you know that Cote d'Ivoire was the world's largest producer of cashews and cocoa, which makes your favorite chocolate bar? This is just one of the many fun facts about the beautiful country of Cote d'Ivoire. But for today's video, I wanted to share six main reasons why you definitely need to visit Cote d'Ivoire. Even if you're not considering Cote d'Ivoire for your black city, it's still so worth it to go and visit. So welcome back to Tokindi Travel. If you've been here for a while, you know that we are considering moving to Cote d'Ivoire or Cameroon for our black set. I visited Cote d'Ivoire twice right now and it's at the top of our list of places we wanted to go. If you want to know more about why Cote d'Ivoire, I'm going to link a few videos in the comment. But like I said, for the purpose of this video, I wanted to share with you some of the many reasons why you definitely need to consider Cote d'Ivoire for a trip just to visit or even for your black set. I realized that a lot of people don't know much about Cote d'Ivoire. And that's the case for many of the francophone or French speaking countries in Africa. So Cote d'Ivoire is located in West Africa and as neighbors to the West, it has Liberia and to the East, Ghana, which a lot of people are more familiar with. So here are the six main reasons why you absolutely need to go to Cote d'Ivoire. Stay until the end of this video because I'm going to share something really special with you. So number one reason why you absolutely need to visit Cote d'Ivoire is because of the hospitality. Cote d'Ivoire is known as the land of hospitality. Ivorians are well known in the continent for their fun loving way of life to be like we say in French sans façon meaning that they really make a point of enjoying life and they are known to be the life of the party. Historically Cote d'Ivoire has actually welcomed a lot of different nationalities in the area so you will have a very diverse population in Abidjan specifically. Cote d'Ivoire is definitely the place where you will feel welcome as a foreigner whether you want to just go for a visit or to actually move there. Number two is culture, very rich culture with a lot of different ethnic groups, a lot of different languages and dialects that are spoken there, even though French is an official language that most everybody speaks in Cote d'Ivoire, you'll be able to see a very rich and diverse culture there. You'll see it in food, in art, in music and a lot of different areas. Oh, and another fun fact about Cote d'Ivoire. Did you know that the world's biggest church was located in Cote d'Ivoire? Our Lady of Peace of Yamsuko. Yeah, look it up. That's just another fun fact. Number three is biodiversity. Ecotourism is booming in Cote d'Ivoire right now. So even though Cote d'Ivoire has lost about 90% of its forest, yes, 90%, the government is really pushing for ecotourism, not only to preserve what they have right now, but also to teach the next generation about the importance of coexisting with nature. So you will have a lot of eco lodges in the middle of the forest. You will have a lot of travel agencies that specialize in ecotourism. And you will also see a lot of pristine white sand beaches all along the coasts. Number four is safety. Is it safe to travel to Cote d'Ivoire? This is a question that a lot of Americans will have. Yes, it is 100% safe. The country has solid and growing infrastructure. And this actually leads me to point number five, which is business opportunities. Because of the economic and political stability, it has attracted a lot of foreign investors. And there are also a lot of business opportunities for young dynamic entrepreneurs. So if you want to start a business or if you're like me and you have an online business that you want to run from there, this is something that is 100% doable because depending on where you are, the internet is very reliable and you will not experience a lot of blackouts. So these make for a great business environment, whether you are visiting or if you want to move there. Number six reason why you absolutely must visit Cote d'Ivoire is related to the culture is because of the events that are always happening. There are all kinds of events happening in Cote d'Ivoire, whether they are cultural events like festivals or business events, all kinds of conferences. I personally went to a great marketing event when I went last November. All these events are great signs of a dynamic economy, of a dynamic society that is really, really growing. And for all of you soccer fans out there, Cote d'Ivoire is hosting the next AFCON, which is the African Cup of Nations. So if you're a fan of soccer or football, this is definitely a great occasion for you to go and visit and experience what the country has to offer. So now that you have all these six great reasons to go visit Cote d'Ivoire, you might be wondering, okay, how do I make it happen? Where do I start? How do I go there? I don't know anybody there. Well, I'm here to help you out because the bonus reason why you absolutely must visit Cote d'Ivoire is because I am hosting a trip 
this year so if you want to go on an all-inclusive trip to Kadiba with me where all your meals all accommodation all activities are included then you definitely need to check out the link in the description I'm gonna pop it up somewhere here as well just go follow this link and get all the information you need that way you can join us on an epic exploratory trip to Cote d'Ivoire whether you want to make this trip your scouting trip or you just want to go for fun because why not if you have any questions about the trip just let me know in the comments I'll come back and answer all the questions that you may have or you shoot me an email that works as well there you have it those were the six plus one bonus reason why you absolutely must visit Cote d'Ivoire now I want to know from you which of these seven reasons make you really want to come and visit or move to Cote d'Ivoire just let me know in the comments and as always make sure you like this video share it with a friend and of course subscribe to the channel that way you don't miss any of my other videos like this talking about videos if you want to know more about my recent trip to Cote d'Ivoire I highly recommend you watch this video right here until next time bye bye